Today, the Gulf Coast said its final goodbyes to broadcast icon, the beloved Mel Showers. This morning, the legendary News 5 anchor was laid to rest after his funeral service at the Sanger Theater in downtown Mobile. Many members of the community and the WKRG family were at the service, including News 5's Haley Kennedy. She brings us the sweet words and memories everyone had to share. Well, I would say it's safe to say everyone in Mel Shower's funeral service Saturday morning was at one moment tearing up and then the next laughing. Proof that the News 5 legendary anchor was one loved man. We stand on the shoulders of a giant man who has made an impact, not just in Mobile, but the entire country. He always said love overcomes hate. I'm not gonna lie and say that where he is is better because we all want him here, obviously, but he's reunited with his wife and his daughter now, and I think that that's the best place that he could be. One of Mobile's greatest sons and its voice for half a century. I want to thank you for allowing me into your homes. He just made life a joy. A joy so powerful, even his childhood friends knew his life would be extraordinary. He couldn't help but to be great somewhere. And that greatness broke racial barriers as he became one of the first black TV presenters on air during a time when that was not an idea for black journalists, a legacy that still inspires young generations. He was an amazing news reporter. And a great person, leaving behind a tradition of patience and kindness. He was not a man who judged. He was not very critical about anything. Even if you did something that was demeaning, he smiled and he took it. I say that instead of crying because he left, I think that we should celebrate because he existed. In Mobile, Haley Kennedy, WKRG. The funeral was a beautiful send off for Mel. We will all miss him very much and will never forget his warm nature and the path he paved. If you'd like to watch the service, you can find a recording of the live stream on our homepage at WKRG.com.